Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you're in the world you might be watching. I've often been asked by teachers who uh, teach in young classes in primary schools for uh, children from around about age five upwards, although this particular uh, video will suit children four to five upwards, in developing their ability to use mental arithmetic. And I decided that the best way to do that would be to use an Excel file which enables the parent to help their children add numbers and also to multiply numbers. So you'll see down the bottom here there are two worksheets, adding numbers and multiplying numbers. The answers to the matrix itself, if I add numbers, if I look at the, uh, let's say the number 4, and I go down to the intersection of 4 and 3, I'll see the answer is 7. Similarly, the intersection of 5 and 6 is 11. In the multiply numbers worksheet, multiplying 3, let's say, by 5, will give me the answer 15. So you can use this in addition to the mental arithmetic to help your child uh, if they uh, uh, can't quite get the right answer initially uh, by using mental arithmetic. Let's see how it works. So we'll go back to adding numbers. Here in this cell you'll notice that there is a comment and again this particular file is downloaded, downloadable for free for you from the description but just below the video here in YouTube. So the comment says when using enter the first number then ask your child what the answer will be before you enter a second number. Your child can suggest an answer in two ways, by referring to the array or by using mental arithmetic, preferably mental arithmetic. It develops their brains. Then, after entering the second number, the correct answer will be shown here in this cell. Click the drop-down list to the right of Did you get the right answer? where there is a drop-down list there and you, you can choose yes or no. If the answer is yes, the word excellent appears. If the answer is no, then they can try again. Let's try again as it were. So, multiplying numbers, exactly the same situation. Uh, 3 multiplied by 4 is 12. Uh, 6 multiplied by 9 is 54, so the intersection of the heading and row uh, numbers gives us the right answer. So, let's see an actual example. First of all, I'm going to say to little Billy, I'm going to enter the number uh, 5 here. I can enter 5 from the uh, keyboard, or I can click the drop arrow and enter a number from there. And now I'm going to say to little Billy or little Mary, I'm going to enter the number 4 here. What do you think the answer will be? If they say 9, then absolutely correct. So let's enter the number 4 or click the drop arrow and press enter and the answer is 9. So if little Mary said 9, click here and then yes, the answer is, that she gave you was right. Little Mary, that is absolutely excellent. Now, if she said the answer was 8 after you entered the number 4, then you could say, well, look, uh, 5, and we'll go down to the 4. There's the intersection there. The answer is actually 9. So what we're doing, we're teaching the child to add numbers in their head, mental arithmetic. Now let's see the multiply numbers. Works in exactly the same way. I'm going to enter the first number, and there again is the uh, the comment for you if you wish. We'll enter the first number, we'll say uh, 2, and I'm going to say to little Billy, I want to multiply 2 by 4. What do you think the answer is? And he'll count on his fingers, and he'll say, oh, the answer is 6. So let's have a look here. And we'll enter the number 4, We'll press the enter key. Ah, Billy, the number is 8. Did you get the right answer? No. 
let's try again. So this time I'll go back and I will drag through those cells and delete them. And I'll say, right, Billy, I'm going to enter the number two here. Now, when I enter the second number, which will be four, what do you think the answer will be? And he'll think, and he'll say, ah, it was eight. So two times four is eight when we press the enter key. So now you can say to little Billy, ah, your answer was correct. Billy, that's excellent. Go and get a biscuit. Well, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> okay. So hopefully you'll, you'll find, uh, uh, guys and ladies, that this is a handy way to teach your child to uh, use their brains, develop their sense of numbers, uh, particularly using mental arithmetic. Make sure you subscribe because uh, the next upload that I'll do again to train uh, children will be how we can uh, use uh, money amounts. Uh, if somebody uh, gives the shop assistant a dollar and the cost of the goods was 56 cents, how much change should I get? So again, it will be mental arithmetic. So if you subscribe, and we'd love to have your subscription, likes and comments, you'll be automatically advised in your, on your email uh, when the next upload is available. Thank you so much for watching. Have fun with the kids with this file. Remember, it's all free. Thank you again.